Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl on Pokemon Showdown now has random battles. You can access random battles by going to the second column and going to random battles down here in BDSP. So let's go ahead and try out the new format of Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl on Pokemon Showdown. Alright, we get a we get a Leaf Suicle. Oh my god, RC is fighting. And there's actually a bug right now, basically, where unreleased legendaries are level 100. So typically in random battles, you'll have, you know, the weakest Pokemon have the highest levels. But right now, it looks like they haven't implemented that. So my Suicune is level 80, and his Arceus is level 100. And, yep, okay, fine. And my Arceus is Steel-type, so I'm going to lose to the Arceus fighting. Do I have any way of checking Arceus fighting now? Um, my Pidgeot is too slow. My Skeptile is too slow. Um, I think I have to go for a Scald Burn. Like, that's my only option. Yeah, random battles are broken right now. Level 100, oh my god. Oh, 32 only, okay. Scald, we get the burn. Okay, maybe we can win. Maybe we can win. Okay, Calm Mind, let's rest. Maybe our level 80 Suicune can beat the Arceus. Rest, okay. And the good thing is if we can beat the Arceus, then our Arceus is basically going to dominate. Let's sleep talk. Okay, he goes to Rotom Fan. Oh my god, if we can beat that Arceus. Okay, Scald, 45. Um, Rotom Fan is not known for being very powerful. I think we can live. Yeah, 34 only. Okay. Scald, okay, do we get a burn? We get the burn, okay. Now, Volt Switch, we Calm Mind here. He goes to Arceus, hopefully. He goes to Swampert, okay. We can Scald, right? 53 burn. No burn. That does a lot of damage. Is that Bandit? No way, right? I think we can rest, okay. Back to full. Earthquake, okay. Sleep Talk, give me a Scald. Just give me a Scald. And... That Arceus is crazy, level 100, level 100, and we're only level 80. Okay, Suicune. Scald, we get it, we get it, okay. Now what does he go to? He goes to Mightyana. I do not care about Mightyana. Let's sleep talk. Scald, okay. Do we get the burn? We don't. 33. I, will this use Sucker Punch? No, okay. And we just might beat- he, he, we, we win. <laughs> We win versus the level 100 Arceus. Let's get one more game. Okay, and this time we get a good lead matchup. Hariyama versus Kangaskhan. We have an Aggron, a Vileplume, Magnezone, Cricketune, and Espeon. This is pretty decent. I mean, we don't have a Legendary, which kind of... Like, I would rather have a level 100 Legendary. What does Kangaskhan get? Kangaskhan... Okay, it gets Fake Out. And Earthquake, so I don't want to go to Agron on, like, an Earthquake, right? I mean, yeah. Let's go to Vileplume, try and get an Effect Spore. Fake out Effect Spore. No, we don't get it. I think we can Sleep Powder. Oh, this runs Early Bird, right? Oh. Okay, that's good. Oh no, that's not good. Okay. Let's go to Espeon on the Stealth Rock. There we go. And Magic Bounce is kind of broken, because you can do things like that. Let's go to Magnazone. Um, should we Volt Switch into Espeon again? 41, okay, let's try it. We bounce it again. Let's keep messing with him. Magnezone again. He uses Dig, okay? Dig, okay, how do I handle Dig? I can go to Hariyama, or I can go to Vile Plume. Let's go to Hariyama. Dig. Let's use Bulk Up, and let's see if he gets Stealth Rock Up. Yeah, he doesn't get the Stealth Rock up, we predict him perfectly there. Close combat, 84, okay. We maneuvered past the Wormadan Trash. He goes to Kangaskhan. I think we can do the Vile Plume strat again. Vile Plume, give us an ex effect spore. Oh, he uses Double Edge. We get it. Now this gets Early Bird, I think, or is it Scrappy or Early Bird? I have no idea which one it is. Either way, we can Strength Sap, okay. Throw off a Sludge Bomb, maybe. And let's Giga Drain here. We get it, we get the Gold Duck too. This might be Ice Beam. Yeah, okay. Vile Bloom is putting in the work. I wonder what he'll go to now. He goes to Kangaskhan, okay. He's, um... 
See, he's using a Kangaskhan to try and beat Vileplume, which tells me he probably doesn't have a fire type. So I can probably go Espeon on the Kangaskhan. If he double edges, I lose Espeon, no big deal. And if he stays asleep, I can outspeed him next. We we'll go to Espeon here. Fortunately, he still stays asleep. We get a free Psychic off. And he forfeits. Let's get one more game. Okay, we get a decent lead. We are Volt Absorb, which is good. We don't have a Legendary on the team. We can Nasty Plot, probably. Oh, oh, okay. Let's go. 77, yuck. That's so weak. Should I Thunderbolt predicting a switch? I could do that, but... Yeah, I could have done that. I was I didn't want to risk it, though. It is Leftovers. Should we Volt Switch? We can't really Volt Switch into anything besides maybe Slaking. The problem with going Slaking is that if we go to Slaking, that Quagsire is going to heal back to full. Um, I think we can just Thunderbolt and get some guaranteed damage. Okay. 37. Yeah, why would you do that? You could have gone to Quagsire, I mean Parasect first, right? Let's Volt Switch, okay. Zatu or Noctowl? Let's go to Zatu. Bounce back a Spore, maybe. Okay, x -Hizzer. That does a lot of damage. Psychic? I should have used Air Slash him, so... Okay, this guy fortunately doesn't know what he's doing, but I could have... I should have used Air Slash there. Now he goes to Rotom Fan. Let's go to Minum on a Electric move. Nice. Volt Switch here. Let's go. He's going to use a flying type move, right? Let's go to Skunk Tank. Okay. Air Slash. Let's throw off a Poison Jab. We are slower, unfortunately. Oh, that sucked. Now, um, kind of tough, right? We can Poison Jab go for a Poison Fish. Okay, he goes to Quag. Let's Taunt so he can't recover. And now let's go to Noctowl. He might Earthquake. Yeah, he does Earthquake. Let's throw off a Hypnosis or a Hurricane? Hypnosis. We're gonna hit the Rotom Fan. I... Okay, we didn't. We can throw off another one. Okay. Okay, that's good. Now, how do we actually break through the Rotom and Quag? We can go to Polyrath, maybe? Okay, that didn't work. How do we actually do this? Let's go to Slaking now. And Giga Impact. I, I don't think Aqua Jet would kill. Okay, that's good. So he is going to heal Quagsire, unfortunately. But... Let's go to Noctowl. I think Noctowl can actually beat the Quag. Noctowl. Scald. He gets the burn, which is good. I can't be toxic anymore. 42. Called. We can roost here. Now, how do we actually beat the Quagsire? He goes to Rotom Fan, okay. 41 and the Confuse. Let's go to Slaking and throw off a Giga Impact. Okay, Giga Impact incoming. There we go. We get one kill. Slaking in business. He'll probably go to. Okay, he goes to Shaman Sky. Oh no. Oh no, this is a problem. Oh, and it's a Legendary too, level 100. Random battles are so broken. It's a level 100 and I have nothing for it. Let's sacrifice Minum here. Oh, he has a level 100 Legendary too. Air Slash is going to flinge. Okay. Let's go with Zatu. We'll try and break the sub with Air Slash. Hopefully he doesn't flinch, but he has a level 100 Legendary. Oh man, random. Okay, he goes for Seed Flare. Do we break the sub? We are level 80? We break the sub, okay. We do break the sub. Air Slash here. Now we have to go to Noctowl and we have to hit the Hurricane. Let's see if... Okay, he's using Substitute. Good play from him. We just have to hit one, maybe get a Confusion. He goes to Quag, okay. This is definitely going to be tough. Do we have Ice Punch? We don't even have Ice Punch on Polyrath. Let's go to Polyrath now. Let's Rain Dance and try and Waterfall Flinch. Okay, we dodge. We need one of those. Waterfall, flinch. Okay, we just need one flinch. 44, we just need one flinch. That's all we need. 44, no, just one. Give me one. 41, 
We just need one flinch. Now it's 47. No, we don't even get one flinch. Yeah, and we're going to lose to that Shaman Sky now. Let's go and Giga Impact. 100, okay. Now, can we maneuver through that Shaman Sky? Can we do it? I think Noctowl with the Rain Hurricane... Okay, and he has two legendaries. What the... He has two legendaries. Level 100 legendaries. How can I compete with that? Okay. Okay, I can, I can compete with that. Okay, let me Sucker Punch here. Right? 42, yeah, that is level, level 100 for you. He has two level 100 legendaries. Random battles are so broken right now. Let's go to Skunk Tank. Let's Crunch. And then maybe... 24. Oh, man. Man, I really hope they fix... Oh, Poison Jab. Do we get the Poison? 20? No, we don't even get that. Yeah, yeah they really didn't fix the bug right now. <laughs> Random battles are so funny. Like, I can't compete with two level 100 legendaries. Okay. Let's hurricane here. Last shot. Maybe we dodge an air slash. We get a hurricane confusion, maybe. Okay. One more. Okay. One more. Come on. Just give me one more. No. We had a chance. We had a chance if we could... Okay, we can dodge a Seed Flare. No, we don't get it. GG. Random battles are so broken right now. For Alligator, do we have a Legendary? No Legendary. All we can do is hope he doesn't have one either. Let's Thunderbolt. Should I Volt Switch into Quag? That's an option. Let's do that. Volt Switch into Quag. So if he goes to a Grass-type, we're okay. We don't need to Thunderbolt here. Okay. Um, do we have a Rocky Helmet or something? We don't. We can... Honestly, this is really annoying. Let's go to Quag. And we'll throw off a Toxic. See if he has a switch in to Toxic. He goes to Crobat. He does have a switch in. Can we Scald here? Oh, this has Toxic. That was a bad play for me. We get the burn, fortunately. Let's go and get Stealth Rock up for... Oh no, he'll go to for Alligator now. Okay, let's go to Quag. And see what he does. He Dragon Dances, let's get a Toxic off. And I think Electrode actually does outspeed for Alligator. Okay. Let's recover. 35 only. Let's recover. And maybe we can try and set up the Hitmon Lee win. I think this is going to be the last game, because there's really no point playing with the level 100, level 100, level 100 legendaries. It's just way too broken. Um, Intimidate? Nah. Let's just Earthquake. Get some chip damage. 33. That is going to be at 342 health, right? I mean, speed. Sudowoodo with Sucker Punch. Let's go. Oh, does this get Aqua Jet? I don't think so. I mean, I don't think it runs Aqua Jet. Okay, yeah, there we go. Hopefully, we can get Stealth Rock up. I hope he doesn't have another water type. But yeah, this is going to be the last game. There's no point playing in a broken metagame. Let's uh, Stealth Rock. I don't think Surf one hit KOs, right? Yeah, there we go. Let's Sucker Punch. Okay. Let's go to Electrode. Let's Light Screen. And try and win with Hitmonlee. It is risky because we don't know the last two Pokemon. But... Ooh, I, I don't have a free switch in because Explosion is going to one-hit KO. Yeah, okay. Let's go to... Um, I think he might lead with Crobat, right? To Defog. Let's lead with Entai. Okay. Sacred Fire. Yeah, I think we might win with Hitmonlee. Oh, he's going for an SD. I don't know why. Okay, that's an easy play. Now what? Does he have a water type? He goes to Crobat, which makes me think he doesn't have anything for Entai. He's trying to roost his way out. 73, okay. He gets the Toxic off. Oh yeah, he can't beat Entai. Unless he has a level 100. Okay, he has a Gengar. Which I coincidentally cannot fake out. Okay, I do have to be careful. But Sacred Fire. Okay, please hit the attack. There we go, we win. 
and that's going to wrap up the live. Hopefully they'll fix the random battles ladder soon, but if you want to uh, partake in the craziness, you can go ahead and get a game now.